Stephen, defeat in the UEFA Youth League against Shakhtar Donetsk, how do you reflect on that 90 minutes? Uh, listen, we can't ask for any more than what the boys have given us in this tournament. You know, there's one game to go. Um, again, there's loads of positives to take from it. Some of the individual performances were terrific and we felt it was just a case of when you were on top of the game, you never took your chances, um, which at this level and at the top end of the uh, uh, football, you need to take your chances when you're on top because you know when you're against a, a, a very good opposition that they're going to then have a couple of opportunities as well. So, unfortunately, we never took them. If we break the game down and look at the first half, as you mentioned, we did have lots of opportunities on goal and then the big chance comes with a penalty in 19 minutes, yeah. which unfortunately Adam Brooks puts wide of the post. On reflection, is that just a big moment for the game? It is, you know, listen, and then when you've got an opportunity to, to, to score for the spot, you know, listen, Adam's one of the best young finishers that, that, that I've worked with. You know, he's a terrific lad. He works really, really hard in his game and the, 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 the goals will come. You know, that he's, he's, he's in moments like that, he'll feel as if the full world's on his shoulders at that point, but it's absolutely not. You know, he's, he's, he's a terrific lad, a brilliant worker, and the goals will always come for him because he's that type of player. So it's a collective. Uh, we lost the game collectively, like I said, they're a very good side. But we gave another good account of ourselves, and again, we're just disappointed that, that the result probably doesn't um, show the performance levels that we had. So loads and loads of positives. Again, we've, we're trying to implement how, we've, how we try and play. We've been very consistent with that. And, and again, we can't ask for any more with the boys and what they give us. They give us absolutely everything on a daily basis. Um, and just unfortunately, we, we never get the, the result the performance deserved. So much of this competition is about it being a learning opportunity for the players and for the group to take with them in future campaigns. So far, we've had five match days. What do you think the main learning opportunities have been from the competition and this game? It's, the, the boys face different tactics, um, different style of players, different a, a whole new level of player that, that they've probably been used to. You know, the, previously they'll play teams in tournaments under twelves, under thirteens, under fourteens. But this is you now getting into, into the elite, the elite. Uh, levels of European football and that's where we need to be judged on because we're trying to produce players who can play in our first team and compete in the Champions League level so it's been a brilliant experience for the boys and the biggest thing that they can take they've now experienced it and they know that some of our boys were the best players on the pitch and I think out with the Madrid game and the first game when you look back in the games some of our boys individually have been the best players on the pitch which is, is terrific and it's something that they should take massive, massive confidence from and as you mentioned, still one game left to go in this competition. Real Madrid away next week. I know the boys will be deflated at the moment, but that's a game that must get the boys really excited. It, it does. Listen, we are, we're, a, we're a staff that demands from them every single day. Um, if you want to then produce players, that's what you've got to do. Um, the players have bought into everything that, that, we've, that we've tried to do since the first day of pre-season. Um, and again, the Madrid game, we'll go at it, we'll go there having a right good go at them as, as we always do and we'll go there trying to win the game.